Hello and welcome to the next episode of the Mod of Docking series. Today we are going to dive into AI vision and the use of pre-trained machine learning models. So what's on our agenda today? We are tackling a practical challenge. We have a photo of a car with a visible license plate and our goal is to first detect the license plate, then enhance it a little bit and finally read it as a string. But how exactly do we want to do this? Normally, one might use machine learning in the, the purest form, starting from the scratch to model the neural network or some other structure. However, this approach can be quite overwhelming in the long term, considering the vast amount of information and the knowledge required to effectively implement ready solution. Here, we can take a smarter approach, Instead of starting from scratch, we can utilize pre-trained models. A great website for this is Hugging Face CO. It's an extensive repository with a wide range of models that are ready for immediate use in our projects, complete with helpful examples, tutorials and detailed documentation. For our task today, we are going to use two specific models, the Ultralytics YOLO and the Microsoft TR OCR. But let me outline the plan. We are going to create three functions. First, detect license plate. And in here we are going to use the YOLO. YOLO stands for you only look once. And it's an incredible model family capable of detecting objects in the photos and videos in real time. It's not just limited to the detecting license plates. It can identify people, animals and much more depending on the specific model we choose. The second one is the enhanced process. The enhancement process will be relatively straightforward as we won't be relying on the complex libraries. Finally, reading the license plate, which will utilize two mechanisms. First part will demonstrate how to use a pre-trained model from Microsoft and the other one will involve using Tesseract, an external OCR tool. But enough of talk and let's get our hands dirty with a hugging face and find the YOLO model. As you can see, there is a documentation about the installing and inference of the model in our project. Now, let's get into the coding part. Define the method to detect the license plate. What do we have in here? Here we loaded the model, as the documentation said, over the hugging face. This specific model is designed for this purpose and it's ready to use right off the box. It also offers additional parameters which can be tweaked as needed. Then we perform an inference by passing the image path. As a result, we have the detected license plate, but we need to do something with it. We can crop it and save it into the file in order to perform next steps on it. We have plate cropped and that's brings us to the enhancing the image, because standard OCR tools like the Tesseract may struggle with the raw images, a bit of enhancement is necessary. Our enhancement method involves converting the image into the grayscale, as we don't need the colors for our OCR, then we increase the contrast, the sharpness and scale it a little bit. Additionally, we have methods for removing the dark frame and shades around the license plate. The easiest way to do this is by using the OpenCV library. We convert the image into a NumPy array and then perform the necessary enhancements. After finding the contours, we crop the frame from the license plate. We also remove the shades, it's especially helpful when the car is in low light conditions. The result is a cropped license plate without the frame and enhanced. It's not perfect, but it's now easier for Tesseract to perform the OCR on it. Now, let's discuss the reading process. As I mentioned, there will be two methods. The first one involves Tesseract and it's quite simple. We use image-to-string method from the Tesseract library, passing the whitelist of characters. It's pretty straightforward, but it brings some problems. The valid-to-invalid answers ratio is not too good for the Tesseract. The second method involves using the pre-trained Microsoft model, which we retrieve from the hugging face. It's just uh, performing the inference on the model. 
As the result, we are getting the license plate content. Time to test our setup. I wrapped everything into the TechPy file and performed it on the photo we discussed at the beginning. The results? Tesseract did detect the text. However, from my testing, it seems that Tesseract isn't always the perfect solution. Sometimes it failed to detect a text from the enhanced images or even confused similar looking characters like 5 with S, 8 with B and so on. But the Microsoft model, in the majority of the cases, was spot on. It gave the correct results constantly, but a little bit slower. However, do note that I tested the inference on the CPU, not the GPU. It's likely that the performance would be better on the GPU. So, today we implemented a method to detect and read the information from an image. Remember, if there are pre-trained models available, it's wise to use them as you use the libraries and frameworks. They are available for a public use for a reason. So, thanks for watching and see you soon! Let me know in the comments what do you think about it.